Okay, today we're going to take a look at how we can get music from our Samsung phone onto our Samsung Galaxy Watch. A friend of mine asked this, and it didn't seem intuitive at the beginning, but then once you realize what the steps are, very simple, very easy, very intuitive. So let's take a look at how we do that. So for me personally, I use Samsung Music. It's just the default app that's on the phone and the one that came with it. And it works fine for how I listen to my music. So we can see here, we've got a list of music. And if we want to take a song, we'll choose this one, Nico and the Niners, and share. And the list will come up. All we have to do is go to Galaxy Watch select the Wear app. It's going to request permission on your watch. We'll unlock it. We get a notification to ask for permission. We'll select that. And the permission is to allow permission required to add tracks. View the permissions. It's asking for the device's location. I'm not really sure why it's asking for location, possibly uh, for Wi-Fi and all that kind of stuff. But we'll say while using the app. Allow Galaxy Wear, allow Galaxy wearable music to access photos and media on your device. Yes, because this is how it's gonna download the artwork and stuff like that from the phone. So once we've, allowed those two permissions, we can go back to our phone and select retry. Okay. And after about uh, 15 seconds or so, the transfer starts. So at this speed, I, was, I would suspect that this is being sent over Bluetooth. That's not the fastest transfer in the world. But if you're transferring 20 or 30 songs, you know, it might take a few minutes. And now we can go on to our watch and we can see here in our notifications, we have one added track. We can select that, let's open it. And now we want to allow music to access our files on our device. Yes, we allow. And here's our song that we've added. We can click on play and it plays from the phone. Okay, and then if we wanted to add multiple songs out of Samsung Music, we select, we press and hold, we select the music that we want to add, and then we click on share at the bottom. Again, go to Galaxy Watch. And at this time, because we've already given it permission, it should just start transferring. So like before, we'll give it about uh, 15 seconds and we should see the transfer start. And there we go. So we can see what time it is. 12.07 and 45 seconds. And we'll see how long this takes. Okay, and our transfer is done. Awesome. So let's take a look at how this looks on our watch. So if we open up the music app, we can swipe up from the bottom and we can select our library. So let's go library. We can see the albums, artists, and tracks. We can go to tracks and we can see what tracks we have here. Okay, the one that's currently playing has the little blue equalizer on it. We can select the track and go to that. And swipe up, we can see our queue. And this is the list of songs that we have queued up to play. Fairly easy, fairly straightforward. I have my dial set to control the volume. So turn it up and turn it down. And our play pause. 
we will turn this all the way down. We will play. And if we go home, we can see here that we have the music icon jumping, indicating that we have music playing. If we select it, it drops us right back into the music app on the watch. And that is pretty much how we get music from our phone to our watch. This is going to be useful for me when I'm doing uh, work outside in the yard. I typically don't bring my phone outside in my pocket. Um, you know, I usually just have my watch on and I leave my phone on the inside. If I need to take a call, I can do it from my watch or my Galaxy earbuds that I have. Uh, they've got a decent enough range that I can do work around the house without having my phone on me in my pocket. So I'll be able to listen to some music connected to my earbuds and uh, control everything from my watch. So I hope this has helped you getting music from your phone to your watch or just music onto your watch in general. If you don't have the Samsung music app, you can still transfer music to your watch the same method. I think we could just go to say for instance ES File Explorer. We can select music on here. I'll let it load up. So lots of music here. We can select and hold one. Go to more, select share. And again, select the Galaxy Wear app. It will app open this up and it will transfer your file. Now this is specific to Samsung, this transferring whatever app you've connected with your with your specific phone may operate differently in adding tracks or adding files to your watch but the the watch's music app should pick up those music files and put them in the right location for you automatically so let me know in the comments down below if you've had the same experience uh, if you have another android phone if it's just as easy to transfer music to your watch or if you just leave the music on your phone. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.